I think the greatest strength in uh, the youth in the chapter for Miami is the, the bonds that we have within each other. Uh, we, especially when we go and do things, <laughs> salsa, choir, everything's interconnected. I mean, everyone enjoys, everyone goes inside in, into, the, into the activity that we're doing. And we all cooperate and we all have a really, really, really good time. And we show everyone a sense of uh, family, especially that's, is, if it's not present in their house, we, we try to give them as much as we can here. Um, as far as that is concerned, uh, I think we're doing a really good job, and that's one of the things that we really, really capitalize on when we have a new member come and want to participate in any of our activities. We have them dance salsa, but not just have them dance salsa, we have them laugh and cheer with us, you know, and share things with us. and. You like if we were all brothers and sisters in that, in that kind of aspect. Uh, all I would really be able to do is agree with what he said. Like even outside of youth move, uh, like, for example, him and I we're, we're like real close friends, almost like almost like family. Even outside of youth move, and anytime any person comes here, we just open up the circle and let them join in. It's just it's really fun. It's just nice to be here. We that's what we do with everyone that comes here every time. Kukum kum 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 kukum kum 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 Okay, one of the good creations that Yuku has created is our chorus and our salsa class. Our chorus provides four voices and it's completely a cappella. And we all sing and harmonize together. It's really good because it's a stress reliever. So I know a lot of kids carry a lot of stress nowadays because of school, homework, and some of us work, like me, guilty. So um, one of the things that helps me release my stress when I'm like really, really not having it and having a really bad day is when I sing and it's my natural and good stress reliever. You, Allison? Sure. Um, I think it's a good creation of uh, expressing ourselves through the arts. It's a stress reliever, but as well, I believe and very um, advocate to educate ourselves, the youth especially, about um, mental health wellness and pretty much to educate ourselves to break down the stigmatism of like bipolarism and depression. And um, that pretty much just because I have depression doesn't mean my life is going to be about gloom and doom. So I want to get educate myself and others um, about my situation because there's so many things that I don't know. And um, definitely there's a story of recovery and it doesn't happen overnight. So I want that to be known and it's life is just a process and um, I want that to inspire others to hope and then that they're not alone. You have an attic living in your house. Your family must be crazy. You're You'll never make it. Your family never make it. You'll never make it. I thought You'll I hit you. I thought I hit you. I thought I hit you. I thought I hit you. You're stupid. 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 You're good enough. You're good enough. We're no different from anybody else. We're no different from anybody else. I have people who love me. I have people who love me. You're beautiful just the way you are. You're beautiful just the way you are. We have a variety of colors. We have a variety of colors. Everyone learns differently. Everyone learns differently. You have a great personality. You have a great personality. Okay, one of the reasons I am in youth move is because I like the idea of being able to advocate and fight for a cause that I believe in and to convince other people to believe in as well. We um, like to 
go for the cause of mental awareness and substance abuse and how to not stigmatize or victimize people because of it and just because you have problems we all have problems it's like life when you go to the hospital life isn't a constant line there's always ups and downs to it and yeah people with substance abuse and mental health awareness issues have it some bit harder than we do but uh, you move it's our job to not prejudice over people and not to discriminate for them things we treat everybody as equals and i like the fact that even though we have problems, we all have each other's back and we all have our supports. Um, what, I have, what I have accomplished with Youth Move, um, it's made me a nicer person because I used to be a hardcore, raging, mean person. I still kind of am. I have anger issues and um, <laughs> it doesn't really work out for me. But Youth Move has made me see the other light and a, other, another type of kind of shade to people and how I don't have, always have to treat everything negatively because I'm just a pessimistic person, it shows me how positive things can come out. Why am I part of Youth Move? Well, it's a good question. I am part of Youth Move because throughout my life I've dealt with issues like depression and recently found out I have anxiety. And that I come to a place where I feel at home. I'm comfortable here. I am free and um, I don't have to face prejudice because I am surrounded by people who know what it feels like. You know, and um, I have a brother who has a mental disability, and I came here to find help, and so far I have. Um, the staff and the members are very kind, they're supportive, and I need that in my life. You know, I can't find that at home, so I look for family elsewhere, and I found it here. Um, what have I accomplished? Um, I communicate better amongst others and myself. Um, I am able to ask for what I want and what I need here, you know. Um, before I, I was too scared to ask for help and also because there's prejudice against if you have a therapist or if you have some type of mental health disorder, you're automatically damaged or dysfunctional. And I learned here that it's just part of life and you have to cope with it and um, it's not the end of the world. And I wanna let others know that they're not alone and there's help here. This is a living room. This is a living room. I mean, I don't mean because there's couches here. I mean, this room is full of life. It is a living room. It is a room chock full of life where families gather. I am alive in a living room. And your group, has created a living room. Not with an Xbox, not with a TV set, not with a bunch of iPads, but with love. You have created a place and a space where you can come together and enjoy one another. I'm a part of Youth Move because I, have, I live with a single mother and she usually spends a lot of time working, so I spend a lot of time usually alone at my house. And that's what's caused me to go down a bit of a dark road to where I started to think very negatively about a lot of things. So one day a friend of mine had invited me to come and I did and they, they, uh, here they welcomed me like a, like a home. So it, it, it felt really nice to have that so I decided to become part of Youth Move to help spread that, that feeling of, of friends and you know, family and a feeling of unity to spread something you know, big. And and through this, I've uh, I've managed to sort of find new ways to sort of cope, or you know, or find just a vent to, to have when you when you're thinking negatively, or when you're just not feeling good on certain days. Allowed me to learn ways to, to help yourself. Uh, I uh, joined Youth Move. Uh, knowing especially the generation that I grew up in and being one of the more you know older people in the group uh, I realized that the generation that I was growing up in a lot of the kids were having problems and a lot of the kids were just emotionally stressed out especially when I was in high school and as a young child I saw the stigma in a lot of the kids and I wanted to, to share what I had with my family that the feeling of welcomeness and the feeling of, of, of being okay I joined uh, because I wanted to share that and now since I'm the, you know t the teacher of salsa 
and you know participating in the choir we get to show kids how to break out of that shell of, of not having self-esteem um, having confidence in themselves to do things and not worry about what other people think about you because the things that you do are beautiful and you're all everyone's beautiful on the inside no matter what you think uh, what I've benefited from is I've, I've been around these kids that are artistically talented uh, they dance and they sing. They, they never knew they could. They were able to do things and they were able to be part of, of greater, greater things. And I'm able to be witness to that. And I've grown in confidence, you know, sharing my stories with kids and being with them and showing them that there's, you know, there's a lot of bad things in life, but look at all the good things that we're able to do, accomplish, especially together. And those things that people think about you, you don't have to worry about it because you're, you're, everyone's beautiful and everyone's beautiful inside.